Each of the 17 exhibits celebrates different aspects of the Big Easy through the local artist perspective. Each room brought a different flair from the seafood boil to out of this world dimension to inspiration from Hurricane Katrina itself. I love that we had a block of time and weren't rushed through. So we can take our time, take pictures, and interact with each room. But my favorite exhibit was all the way at the end, being new to the gift shop. We walked through a lot of local and world life. If you are in New Orleans, this is a must. Let's head uptown, we're heading to get some dinner right in the street park. It's already really beautiful so far. 
We're going to hopefully get to catch the sunset here, and it's great to have all this. I forgot I had the camera on. <laughs> Oops. All right, so we here at Burger Street at night. Let's go. New Orleans, most powerful drink. What is that? How was your How was your bath? How was your bath, Chapatik? Look how that drink. I like it when he blew up. Like a cotton candy. We just had an amazing breakfast at a hotel, the Hilton Embassy Street, and we just checked out. So what are we doing now, Lynn? <laughs> He's adorable. So, yes, yes you, you are. are. It's about a 15-minute walk from a hotel, so let's go there. Check you out. That's efficiency from top to bottom. Shake it off. All right, so we're just getting off the ferry, and it was not exactly hot. how to dry up. About five minutes across, and let me tell you, we've been on a lot of ferries around the world and in the United States, and that was the cleanest ferry I've ever seen. It was double decker, so you could get either seat. Today was a beautiful day, so we were out there in the sunlight, but this is beautiful. I mean, the Mississippi water is also beautiful, so it's good that the ferry is good. How was your bath? <laughs> Good, right? I'm going to take the water out. Um, we took the 